Interviewing the cast of Isidengo was a huge surprise. I was chilled when I found out who I was interviewing. Ashish. Ashley Mklop, I did my research very well on him. We had a lot of fun, but let me tell you, the interviews were not easy. Ashish, Ashley Mklop, Oh, you know the name. You know the name. Hi. Ashley Mklop, obviously meaning a white horse. White horse, that's correct, yes. because I, I can run really fast. Oh, okay. Mm. You're a man with speed. It was supposed to take part in the July, but then, you know, oh, it yes. wouldn't work for my outfit. Oh, so, sorry. Sorry. Hello? Hi. Um, uh, oh, um, uh, okay, yeah, no, 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 I'm, 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 you know what, I'll be there in about 10 minutes. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm in Madren, I'm, uh, yeah, just, uh, sorry. Uh, no, 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 don't, listen, this is, this is 350,000 Rand we're talking about, okay, this is, we've been working on this for a long time, so just don't cancel, I'll be there in about 10 minutes, alright? Um, I'm There's one yes, thing uh, I picked up, yeah, uh, when, when, uh, I caught it at the corner of my eye, when the call came in, she did this. What's going on? Uh, yeah, she should have just went with it because I saw that and, and for me when I saw that I thought okay here it goes She's gonna buckle. I'm gonna sell this thing as much as I can go really really huge in it and uh, But she kept it together, you know, listen, I'm, I'm really sorry. Okay, uh, thank you for your time. Yeah, Anyways, thanks. Thank thanks. Thank you. Sorry. Sorry guys I was so mad I wanted to not punch him on his face, but he's too cute to punch, you know, but yeah, it was drama <laughs> Did you, did you forget Shea, something? Where? Or? I'm really sorry. <laughs> it's fine. I'm really sorry. I don't normally do things like that. Six months ago, yeah. Toppling was a part of a very fantastic opportunity. Well, not even an opportunity. Talking about my wedding. Yeah, wedding. Yeah. Uh, wedding. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it was good. Uh, relationship is, is going strong, going fine. Best, luckiest guy on earth. Um. Hi, Zama. Zama. How are you? Hello. Zama, I love your interview at Gold Rift City. I think after you have salvaged it, you did very well, but the beginning was a bit rocky. I think you started off very well, mm -hmm. but then his phone rang and you kind of got like, you rolled your eyes to the camera because you couldn't believe he was answering the phone. And when you came back, it was all that energy was completely fizzled away. I don't think in any interview you should allow the person you're interviewing to have their cell phone there and to have it on. I think it's rule number one. It's so rude that they're not focusing on you. I mean, we went through that with the Kardashians, that Kim Kardashian was SMSing all the time while she was having that interview with Inez. You've just got to be a little bit more, I'm, not, I'm going to say assertive, but in a fun way, because at the moment you're very good and you're very good on camera and you've got this control about yourself but I don't know if you're able to then let it go and be able to have fun and also he said that he was going off to sign a deal so he told you I have to take this call because I'm going to get 350 K's you could have leveraged call. off that yes yeah. you could have now leveraged off now. that that you should have said well you took the call you took my time because. to take the call now tell us did you get that contract what was it for? How do you actually earn 350 k for one gig? What is this gig? And make something of it, because he gave you an opportunity. I value that.